How you doing? Good afternoon. I couldn't wait till Saturday because I had something important to talk about. Okay, lately I've been telling you all about the benefits of keto diets on, on cancer and preventing sugar and glucose and different type of things. But a couple questions have been coming up a lot. If you're on the keto diet, that's not a regular diet. That's a whole changing of the fuel system of your body. So cheating on a keto diet is not like when you cheat on a regular diet that you can start up the next day and everything's fine. It's not like that. Keto diet is like changing the engine on your car. It's no longer gonna be a gas engine. It's like jet fuel engine. So you can't put regular gas in and expect it to run good. The problem with the keto diet, and, and this goes for a lot of you, is if you can't commit to it, you may want to think of something else or really think about what you're doing because when you cheat the next day you're not back on the diet your body you know changes fuel it's going to have sugar in it and probably for a couple of days so you need to be careful on the next day after a so-called cheat it's not a good idea to cheat okay you need to commit to a diet because it's a change of lifestyle it's not don't call it a diet change it change of lifestyle you can't keep cheating because you can hurt yourself that way so there is things you can test strips and you know the keto sticks that you get in the diabetic aisle at walmart you can do that and check if you're in ketosis the next day if it's if you're not then you have to do a strict um, you know salad diet until you're back in ketosis best thing is to do don't cheat we don't ever cheat we eat net carbs so we eat bread replacements that have net carbs. They're fiber carbs, so they don't affect you. They don't affect your blood sugar. So that's okay. But if you eat cake or drink wine or any of that, you're playing with fire. That's one of the downsides of this diet. It used to be impossible because there was no replacements. Back in the 90s, you didn't have anything. The only sweet thing you can have is cheesecake. And it just got obnoxious after a while. But there is every, absolutely anything you want, they have now in keto. Just look for the word keto and you'll be fine. Good luck. I don't want anybody getting hurt and increasing their cholesterol or anything. And you can get hurt and do that stuff if you don't do the diet right. It's like putting diesel fuel in the gas engine. It'll not work right and mess it up. So take care. If you have any questions, you know, you guys know that I can be found. Thanks.